Whew. I just witnessed one of the most exciting Shanghai Shocks games of my life. Marbury's last game playing in the Shack Tank. Now I know we're kind of friends now. We have been through a lot. You know, a lot of, a lot. I'm wearing Marbury's on my feet, but once he steps in the Shack Tank, you know, fucking all, all bridges collapse. Marbury ain't got the juice no more. Oh, no. Nope. Tonight you're sucking my dick. One thing I've found is that a lot of the fans, you know, they used to call Marbury Shabby, which means dumb cunt. Fuck the ducks! Stop it! Fuck the ducks! Stop it! Stop it! They've uh, they've made it PG. They've gone down to calling him loser. Loser! 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 Who, who, who are we calling a loser? Uh, Marbury. Marbury, yes. I'm okay with that because you know, me and me and Marbury like our boys, so. If we're just gonna call him a loser, that's fine with me. I can live with that. What do you guys think of Maburi? Adult! Oh, yeah. Adult, huh? Idiot. Thank you. And he is also a loser. Loser! Bitch, bitch. Sadly, though, when the Shocks needed me most, and the Mormon Megalodon and Starberry were about to chuck Nux, I was busy swimming through a sea of groupies so I could get some beers and Fanta. Yeah, hey, how's it going? How you doing? Sanga Pinjo, Iga Fanta. Oh, and yeah, I always get the, compl the complimentary kettle corn. <laughs> oh, I mean, I put on like a few pounds. Luckily though, Ponytail swooped in to de-escalate the situation. That wouldn't be his only heroic moment this game. What do you need? Bao Bao? Hey, Bao Bao. Bao Bao. Bao Bao's her name. What? I've been calling her Jeanette for like three or four years. Jeanette, how you doing? <laughs> Great to see you again. Yeah. Hey Jeanette, just please, just, just please. <laughs> Guys, just keep it hush hush. At one point, it did not look good for the Shacks. And that was largely due to Duke alumni and ex-Celtic Shavlik Randolph going lights out. Shavlik just hit a lick! Marbury finished a game of only four points. Yikes. A lot of people did not think we were gonna win. Tracy McGrady was sitting courtside, the same seats where I used to sit. He just walked out. He walked out. We were down by like fucking, whatever was it, like five or four with 17 seconds left. He just, he just bounced. But no, no, no. He doesn't, he doesn't know about the Shanghai Shocks. He doesn't know about the Mormon Megalodon. And he doesn't know about my friend Ponytail. Ponytail stole the ball, ran up, and dunked it. This place just erupted. I thought all the water was just gonna spill out of the tank. People were going so crazy. Ponytail put the game into overtime, and then fucking the Megalodon's just clutch. Things looking good. Oh! Holy shit! Oh! Oh! Give her, you animal! He was just fucking boom, boom, boom. He didn't even have shots, just throwing it up. That was the ball game.